YouTube, 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 United Airlines stock is exploding. So thank you guys for tuning in to the Life Changing Finances YouTube channel. Make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe. So United, we know, had their earnings. And let's take a look at the numbers. Let's see what's going on. So although things weren't necessarily perfect, you'll see what's going on. So United Airlines posted a smaller than expected quarterly loss and said issues at Boeing will not derail its full year guidance. Investors are cheering the result, sending shares up 11% as of 10 a.m. Uh, Eastern time. So right now we can see that it's up 16%. United lost 15 cents per share and a quarter on revenue of $12.54 billion, uh, beating Wall Street's consensus estimate for a 57 cent per share loss on sales of $12.45 billion. The company's pre-tax loss was $164 million, which is a $92 million improvement over the same quarter a year ago. So the investors are really liking that. Now, the results included a $200 million hit related to the impact of the grounding of Boeing Max 9 jets in the quarter uh, after an incident involving an Alaska Air Group plane. Without that hit, United would have reported a quarterly profit. So they're saying essentially that the numbers would be better had uh, Boeing had things together. Okay. So as we look at what's going on, we can see that this thing is up 16.2% at the time of this recording. And we've got about an hour and a half of the markets being open. So we can see that uh, at the open, this thing opened up at $43.67. Shot up to about $44. Uh, it looks like $46. And then we worked our way to $48. So let me know what you guys think of this recent move. Uh, is this something that you think is a little bit exaggerated? Or do you think this thing will pull back? You think it's time to put some puts on it, okay? Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. So it looks, it looks like we're near uh, levels we haven't seen in quite some time since it looks like back in uh, 2023. So nice move there. But the question is, can we sustain this run up that we, we have right now? And I'm going to be honest, I'm thinking about shorting this thing, but I, I'll, I'll let you know if I do or not. Okay. Now, let's go ahead and look at what's going on with the options activity. Let's see what the whales really think about uh, United. This may tell us a lot about what we need to know. Okay. So as we look at this thing uh, over the last five days, you can see there's a lot of activity on the call side. On the put side, there's activity too. So essentially, these are uh, investors, whales, that think this thing is not going to sustain this level uh, that it's at now. And they're putting puts on this thing because they think that it's going to come down. So kind of a mixed bag. But uh, it's going to be interesting to see how things turn out over the next couple of days as the 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 news kind of subsides itself, okay? So overall, let me know what you guys think. Um, United Airlines, is is this a, a good stock to short? Uh, how many of you are, are long-term on this thing? Uh, how has your experience been swing trading it, day trading it? I'd be interested to know what you guys think about this uh, recent run-up and your thoughts on if you think that this move is going to su sustain itself. Because when we look at the charts, usually <clears throat> when this thing runs up, it comes down. It goes up and comes down, up and down. You see that? So I don't know. I'm kind of skeptical. I mean, even this one back in uh, January, we went from $39 up to $44 and then came back down lower to $37. And so kind of looking at the history it makes me want to kind of put a, put a put on this thing. Now, I'm not going to say it's going to go under $40 or anything like that, but I think it's got the potential to come back to at least $43 a share. Let me know what you guys think about that. So I appreciate you guys. Uh, make sure you guys like, share, and subscribe. Uh, until the next video, guys, I'm out. Peace.